Two of them are. CD dumbbell press. Right. to do seated press we might have to kick them fucking dumbbells up God. My bad. My bad. Yeah. you're gonna need to get yourself some power hooks you can get them from um, ebay about 40 quid and you're gonna want some uh, early chain get this from like b and q or trade supplies and all that shit uh, and you want to you want three of these some snap clips or snap hooks whatever you want to call them I'm in, I'm in. yeah but chain through pull bars obviously I've already cut this to length but you want to uh, find your height for where you want the dumbbells to, to press from and cut the chain to that length um, I'll just uh, show you See there, put your, put your chain like that, just through there, you bring it forward to the front, right, got one snap clip on here, one snap clip on here, there's me, and what you need to do, is you need to fit, once you've got your, your height that, you, that you're happy with, you need to fit a snap clip to one of the links here, and you've got to connect it to this, this link here, So there you go, once you've got your chain in place and um, you've got your hooks where you want it and you've got your hook clipped, you can see that. It's nice and solid now. Well, it, once you've got your hooks on there, it'll be nice and solid. <laughs> but as it is, chains ain't going to slip. You're going to have the same height and it's not going to go anywhere. So what we need to do now is attach the power hooks to them. Right, so what we're going to do now is we're going to we're going to fit the power hook to the dumbbell. Um, these are really easy to fit, not hard at all. Um, it's just literally like this. Put the hook like that. Like put it underneath. Just going to have to grab all this with uh, my other hand, get my fingers in the way. We've got a band there like that. Flips round underneath, and then the uh, goes back on. And that is literally it. It's, it's attached, it's not going nowhere, and that's it set up. And what you need to do after you've done this is you need to put the power hooks onto the ends of your chains so that they are suspended in the air. I'm in, I'm in. Yeah. Right, so we've got our dumbbell that we were struggling with earlier on. Uh, 15k. And what we're going to do is just attach it to the power hooks. Uh, the chains, uh, just like that, Tommy over style. Same with this side. Well, we'll just uh, adjust that chain for a minute. So we're going off it up. Flip it on. Two sides. That's it. So, as you can see, your dumbbells are now suspended. That show the height where you're going to want them to press from. It's literally going to be a case of push forward, press up, and off you go. Um, when you when you want to, when you finish your set, just bring them down and let them hang. That's all there is to it. In fact, I'll show you now. I usually press the other way. Maybe because I can see what I'm doing. <laughs> I'll press like this. To... So, dumbbells are here. You can literally just push up. Off you go. Simple as that. Yeah. So, as you can 
could say using the power ropes makes it a lot easier to, to press the dumbbells. You don't have to keep them up and all that shit. They're just hanging there and off you go. So if you're doing it from front view, it's not what I use. I usually do it like this so I can see what's going on in the mirror and also I feel this position actually gives me a bit more freedom with the hooks. So I'll just show you. I've loaded the uh, dumbbells up with uh, a heavy weight for me, 35 kilos. Um, this is working pretty near my top end for me at the minute. I know some people can do a lot more and they don't even need to use hooks. Well, I'll just show you. So instead of having to kick them up and panic, you know, to do is really just sort of get, get a bit of motion going, swinging them. When you're ready, just press up. So, swing. And press. Sell power ups with Jane to, to form a spotting system. Uh, you don't have to kick your dumbbells off the floor, it's a lot safer, no, no strain and all that, just off you go. Like, um, relatively cheap to set up, I mean, chains not not that expensive. The ups are like 40 quid, but you can use them for other things like in bench press and that, which I'll, I'll show you in other videos. Um, this has been my first like narrative slash how to video so uh, feel free to give me some feedback and also laugh at my, my poor videoing technique and um, and my, my terrible narrative and, uh, and that's about it so cheers. Mm -hmm.